In this video, we are going to learn about sternal angle. Sternal angle is also known as angle of Lewis. It lies at the junction of manubrium sterni and the body of sternum. At the junction of manubrium sterni and the body of sternum. It articulates on either side with second costal cartilage. It forms an important landmark for counting of the ribs. Sternal angle corresponds to second rib. Events at the sternal angle. Remember the mnemonic hat. H. Horizontal plane through this level separates the superior mediastinum from inferior mediastinum. Another H. Heart. It corresponds to upper border of the heart. Horizontal plane through this level separates superior mediastinum from inferior mediastinum. It corresponds to upper border of the heart. A. Remember aorta, arch of azego vein. Ascending aorta ends at this level. Arch of aorta begins and ends at this level. Descending aorta begins at this level. It corresponds to arch of azego vein. Ascending aorta ends at this level. Arch of aorta begins and ends at this level. Descending aorta begins at this level. It also corresponds to arch of azego vein. Azego vein drains into superior vena cava at this level. Next T. Trachea bifurcates into right and left bronchi at this level. Trachea bifurcation. Trachea bifurcates into right and left bronchi at this level. Next another T. Remember thoracic vertebrae. It lies at the level of intervertebral disc between T4 and T5 vertebrae. Intervertebral disc between T4 and T5 vertebrae. Events at sternal angle. Horizontal plane passing through this level separates superior mediastinum from inferior mediastinum. Upper border of heart lies at this level. Ascending aorta ends at this level. Arch of aorta begins and ends at this level. Descending aorta begins at this level. It corresponds to arch of azego vein. Trachea bifurcates into right and left bronchi at this level. It lies at the level of intervertebral disc between T4 and T5 vertebrae.